So that's true Volkswagen fashion. What is up guys? Welcome back to another video here. Today we're gonna be doing a little bit of GTI stuff and a little bit of truck stuff. So as you can see, um, GTI needs a coolant refresh badly. So that's gonna get ordered pretty soon here. Gonna do a nice uh, CSF radiator, all new aluminum, uh, aluminum crack pipe, aluminum thermostat housing. And we won't do the water pump because fuck it, why not? We gotta order everything because 3-2, we can use all that stuff. So it's not like it's a big waste of money. So. All we have to do is just refresh the gaskets when we swap the motor, which in search of a 3-2. So if you got one, hit me up within the New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Delaware area. I'll drive. So what's up for today is we're going to be almost completing the interior on the GCI. We got um, a Euro switch, eBay one. I didn't go OEM plus shame on me but this is twenty dollars no i think it was like ten dollars on ebay so it's not that big of a deal but then we got an oem black this is out of a 12 valve vr which is weird because they gave gave a black mirror but everything else was gray just like that but that's gonna look way better when you're looking in as you see it just looks stupid to be honest but this is a plug and play uh plug and play unit so that will be black, and then we'll have a nice Euro switch, so I think we can turn on our fogs, which is cool. And then for the truck, we have a little update there. I'll show you guys the exhaust that I got done. It turned out pretty sweet. We are going to be putting a single DIN unit. I got this from Crutchfield. Highly recommend them. Um, they fucking got hit that here in two days, which is pretty crazy with, with COVID and everything. Super fast shipping, so a little update on the GTI as well. The 20th anniversary lips that we had, or the 20th 337 lips that we had, we dropped them off of paint a couple days ago. So that should be done soon as well. And uh, that will be a banger video. Get rid of, make this thing look a little bit more lower, a little bit more body low, and give it like a little bit more of an aggressive look. So I can't wait for that to can't wait for that to be done and uh gti is coming along pretty well and the truck's coming along pretty well too um as you see we did the headlights we did the brakes and that's that there it is service position like that and then you can unplug it and plug the new one in now i should have fogs i believe we'll see so we can have just these interior lights on and then we can turn our headlights on actually yeah and then we can turn our headlights on as you see and then I don't think the fogs are gonna work because I have to wire them I believe I can see I don't know Nah, the fogs won't work Yeah, the fogs won't work, but I think city lights. No, I don't know. I don't really know how it works, but I want to get headlights for this thing soon. So once I get those headlights, the fog fog function will work. So now we will move on to the mirror. That's pretty easy. Just clips, it unclips off. Do not try pulling it off. You will crack your windshield. Some people have to learn the hard way. I did not. Just research anything before you do it. And then all I need is the black door sills. So if you got those, hit me up. So just like that, this mirror is going to be black. With the One Love air fresheners and this cool custom one that my girlfriend got for me. So that was cool. Like that. Alright, so I'm going to have to pick up this video whenever my hand is healed. When I was pulling off that, for pulling off the mirror... The metal clip decided to slice my hand open 
And now I have four stitches. I will insert a picture of it here. I'm going to pick this up whenever I can be more mobile in about a week when I get the stitches out. So GTI is going to sit here for a bit. And I'll see you guys when I am doing this again. We're going to be putting a radio in the 88-98 C1500 platform. So there is the stock unit. We just got a Walmart Walmart uh, head unit with an adapter and then um, uh, two new speakers. So I'm not looking for anything crazy here. I'm probably going to put a sub in this thing eventually. But this is just temporary to hold me over because radio kind of sucks. I'd rather listen to my own music. And we're going over to Shane's right now to... Uh, He's gonna help me out because I fucked up my uh, my thumb here. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I, that, that was two days ago. I was filming a video, but not anymore. So we are going to be uh, getting a little help on this one. Um, should be a pretty straightforward uh, install, but I'm just ex just excited to have Bluetooth and yeah, it's a cheap Walmart setup, probably under 50 bucks. You can have this whole. So, so actually probably under 60 with the speakers but we're gonna get right into it and uh i'll show you guys what i got when i get there all right guys so we are at shane's um i didn't film the process because it's a pretty simple thing i will leave a link to everything that i bought down below i did not install the speakers because i actually looked in there looked in the door and aftermarket speakers were already in there so i just didn't replace them but here it is all done Works as it should. It comes on with the key and uh, turned out pretty good. So, a little update on the truck actually. I got the exhaust fixed. I'll throw a clip of the exhaust like revving um, right here. <laughs> Got that fixed so it sounds really good and uh we did the rear brake lines we did a whole refresh of the system and did the brake master so right now it's stopping pretty good and uh yeah just picking this picking out this truck little by little we're gonna pull the headliner soon get that redone but uh just a little truck update for you guys and uh a little head unit install because you gotta listen to your own music i i hate vehicles without uh listening to my own music and it looks really good in here. And uh, once again, Crutchfield, uh, go to their website. Really good, not sponsored or anything, but really good shit. And uh, got got to my house in two days, so you can't beat that. So yeah, um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Hopefully picking up some stuff for the GTI that I dropped off to paint, which is the lips and side skirts. So then that would be an install video too. And that's gonna change the whole look of the car as well. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.